Hello everyone. Welcome to our good friend P. Diddy's funeral. A family member and a great uncle. He has sadly passed away due to a killer who ate him alive somehow inside of a grocery store. And here we are at our great fr friend's funeral. <laughs> and here's his coffin with his favorite food. Last picture of him in his skull. Last remaining body part when he was eaten. And here today, we have all his family members and everyone. And what I must say is that he was a good person, but also not. But we all make mistakes and sin and hope he goes to heaven. He may not go to heaven. But to his family members, Bruce and Thomas, his nephew, to come up to the podium and talk about his entire life. Where, where? I miss him! <clears throat> no, he was a friend. I lost a real one today. You know, we did so many things normal friends wouldn't do. And that just showed how strong our bond was, really, you know? I mean, yeah, sure, he was weird and liked touching me, but that's what friendship's all about. That does remind me, we became blood brothers back in kindergarten. Hello? Who are you? Why are you crying so much? Can we become blood brothers? Meet me in the bathroom. From that moment on, I knew it would be love for life. But I thank God for the opportunities I had with him. Thank you. Oh, we are cooked! The whole family name is cooked! Diddy was a very ble um, mediocre man at best. I mean, I really never heard him talk that much. Uh, I could I could just be playing work at a pizza place right now, but that kind of has to be here, which I am kind of sad that he's dead. Like, I was the first one to even hear the news that he died because Mr. Link kind of ate him. Speaking of Mr. Link, he was a very normal person. Well, not really. He did do some pretty horrible things in the past. You know what they say, ain't no party like a ditty party, but is this really a ditty party or is this a party to celebrate his death? Because, I mean, he was kind of a horrible person. I don't understand why we care about him. Maybe the the real P. Diddy was the friends we made along the way. Thank you. All right. So, anyone else that would like to speak who are not important at all in this story? Me, please. And I'm very important. All right. You come up and talk about P. Diddy. Yeah. Hey, everyone. I do indeed miss Diddy. He was a great friend. I loved him as if he were my own brother. I truly wish he was still here to take care of our newly born daughter, Liliana, and continue to take great care of Thomas. We miss you, P. Diddy. Thank you for letting me speak. I hope they find that killer. I'll speak now. You know, Diddy, he was the best friend to me. He was more than a friend. He was with me since the beginning. He was my number one, my ride would die, you know what I'm saying. He was my N-word. He was always there for me when I needed help. And I honestly don't know what I'm going to do without he him. He was my boy, man! He was my boy! Now he's gone! Because some fat ass got hungry! I'll never forget that man. I'll make sure that man pays with everything in my body. Rest in peace, my boy! Kitty, you'll never be forgotten. <laughs> Thank you for the speech, so good! Oh! Let me speak. Let me speak about him. Oh, oh, oh. Hi, y'all. I'm, I'm a cool, close friend to P. Diddy. I met him yesterday at the um grocery store. Yeah. And he was he was such a nice guy. He was so Jewish. I mean, such a good person. Yeah. Like, he was so good. And do, do you all guys want to know where we're burying P. Diddy? We're burying him in front of my front yard. Yeah. And all of you might know me, especially you, Spruce. I'm such a good neighbor, right? All right? And I'm very sad about the unfortunate news of P. Diddy's passing. He must have been very delicious. I mean, very good. So thank you all for the funeral. Mr. Ling, you were licking my kid yesterday. No, it was not. You were the one who invaded my home. And we were playing, we were playing role-playing with my son. And you were the one who interrupted and I take him back home. Ah. We're having so much fun. <laughs> Fuck you. That's a lie. He was touching me. No, it wasn't! And everyone, that will be it for the funeral. If you want to stay here for the funeral to watch him be, be buried, then so be. But yes, thank you all for coming to the funeral. Hello, everyone! Welcome!
welcome to my house. This is where we're burying P. Diddy. I must say, he was so delicious. And we are going to be planting him right here. And I know you guys who are family, I know you guys couldn't afford a grave for him. So I did it myself. So you guys should thank me. But yeah, any last words you want to say to P. Diddy? Rest in peace, Diddy. Also, sir, I have a question for you. Can I take his corpse? No! He's mine. Ah. Oh. Stinky boy, I think you wanna go up next, right? You wanna talk about your uncle? Mother don't let me the new titties on the Jeep. I trap into the bloody titties underneath. Cause all my titties got it out the street. I keep a hundred titties and stuff. I think I remember hitting the titty with my whole titty. No one titty dance with calls cause I'm titty. Waking up, getting titty in the morning. I was titty, now I'm titty, titty, titty salty. All this is done on my titty, got me good. Now straight out of the ditty, I'm a ditty. If I gotta find a ditty, I'm a ditty. Miss, that was so good. You sing so good that it tastes so good. And your uncle Diddy would be so proud. He's like in my stomach. Mr. Ling, respectfully, if you say one more word, I will touch you like you touched me yesterday. Rest in peace, my boy. Hey, Spruce, do you want to go drinking after this? Hell yeah. We're going to have a big cheers to Diddy tonight. He's going to hear us up in heaven. Yes, <laughs> sir. Ooh, 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 can I join too? Can I join too? Hell no, no one likes you. Get out of here. Don't worry, my boy. You can join me in my house. I have something important to say. I. Oh, Diddy, I miss you so much. Father, please give him another chance at life. Please, I beg of you. He was my good friend, my partner in crime. Just give him one more chance. Uh, what the heck? Who are you? I'm back. Uh, but you look nothing like Diddy. Diddy, my ball. Uh, okay. Well, I guess you're my partner in crime. Let's go.